Hi friends, today I will show you how to use Visual Basic Programming to find the factorial of a number. Let's start. First open Visual Basic 6.0 from the start menu. Then standard DXC open. First I will increase the font size. First I will increase the font size of the form. Let's make it 18. Then a uh, caption. I will take a label and for making a caption. In the caption property I will write enter enter number. another level I will tick below enter number and I will write in the caption factorial is now for taking the input I will tick a text box beside enter number another text box for displaying the result of the factorial so text box 1 is for taking the input and text box 2 is for displaying the result. Now I will take a command button to execute the program to run the program and to write the code. Uh, I will give the caption factorial. factorial. Now double click on the button to write the code. Friends, I will take three variables. First, to store the value uh, of the number, suppose n, where I will take the input. Another number, another variable for storing the factorial, and another variable i to run the loop as integer. Initially, we will store one in f and we will run the loop for for i i equal to 1 2 since the number okay friends uh, i will place another button another uh, we have to take the input n equal to text one dot text for taking the input now the loop will run from one to n n is the variable to store the number whose factorial where whose factorial we are going to find for i equal to 1 to n step 1 inside for loop f equal to f into i next now we are going to display the result in text box 2 so text 2 dot text equal to Press F5 to run the program. Suppose I will give 4 in enter number whose factorial is 4, 24. Because we know 1 into 2 into 3 into 4 gives 24. Suppose if we give 5, factorial will be 20, 120. Again, if we give 7, it will be 5040. So, that's our program for finding the factorial view project object we have used two labels to give the heading enter number and factorial is in text box one we are storing the value 
whose factorial is going to be find out and we are displaying the result in text box 2 so in n variable we are going to store the input using text box 1 f is initialized to 1 and the loop will run from 1 to up to that value end and finally outside the loop will will display the result in text box 2 again i am running the project run start if i give 5 the factorial will be displayed 120 thank you friends be with us please comment section comment in the comment section and uh, let me know if there is any problem with the video i will try to give you more videos like that very soon please stay with us thank you